Lesson three. Areas of some geometrical figures. The rhombus is a parallelogram has two adjacent sides which are equal. The properties of the rhombus, as shown in the figure, number one, all its sides are equal in length. Number two, the diagonals are perpendicular to each other, but they are not equal in length. Number three, the diagonals bisect the angles at the vertices. Surface area of rhombus equals length of base times height. Example: In the opposite figure, the side length of rhombus equals six centimeter. Its height equals five centimeter. Find its surface area. Solution: Surface area equals length of base times height equals. Six times five equals thirty centimeters squared. Surface area of a rhombus equals half the product of lengths of its diagonals. Example: The lengths of diagonals of a rhombus are six centimeter and eight centimeter. Find its surface area. Solution: The surface area equals. Half the product of lengths of its diagonals equals half times six times eight equals twenty-four centimeters squared. Example: The perimeter of a rhombus is fifty-two centimeter. Length of one of its diagonals equals ten centimeter. Find its surface area. Solution. The side length equals the perimeter divided by four. Equals fifty-two divided four equals thirteen centimeter. Since the diagonals are perpendicular and bisect each other, then BM equals MD equals five centimeter. In the triangle AMB. Am squared equals thirteen squared minus five squared equals one hundred forty-four. Then Am equals twelve centimeter. Therefore, Ac equals twenty-four centimeter. Then the surface area of rhombus equals half times ten times twenty-four equals one hundred twenty centimeter squared. The square is a parallelogram that has two adjacent sides which are equal in length, has a right angle, or it is a rhombus that has a right angle. The square properties: number one, all sides are equal in length; number two, all angles are equal in measure; measure of each of them is ninety. Degrees. Number three, the diagonals are equal in length and perpendicular, and bisect each other. Surface area of the square equals length of side times itself, or half square of length of its diagonals.